Hello world, welcome to my channel. I am Sahil and I am developing a CRUD application with image upload using Node.js, Express, MongoDB and EJS templating engine. And this is the third video of the series in which I am going to show you how to design home page and add users page. Okay. But before starting, if you are looking for a cheapest and fastest reseller web hosting with unlimited bandwidth and unlimited SSD storage, then just visit DomainRacer.com. Domain Reset provides unlimited cPanel accounts and 99.9% .9 uptime guarantee. If you want to know more about all the plans and features of reseller hosting, then check the link in the description box. In last, I will also show you how to deploy this CRUD application in uh, Linux shared hosting using cPanel in DomainRacer.com. Okay, now let's come to this tutorial. In previous video, you have already seen that how I have set up this project like downloading required packages, creating server and also connected this application with the local MongoDB database. Okay. Now let's start designing our application. Okay. So for this first, I will start the server. Okay. So just write npm start here. Okay. To start the development server okay so here you can see server started at this address okay so just open this address in web browser here you can see a message cannot get slash okay because i have not defined any home route that's why we are getting this type of message here okay if we come back here and go to routes.js file then here i have already already defined a route that is this slash users okay so just remove this users from here and change the message to home page okay if i save this and here if i refresh then you can see we are getting the message home page okay in the home route similarly we will create another route for all the pages okay but but first let me create one more directory in the root that will be views directory okay so just create views directory and inside this views directory i will create a new file that will be index.ejs file okay and this will be our home page okay so here what i will do is i will just use this html5 boiler palette code and in title i will just remove this one and here i will use sorry ejs output tag and here i will write title here i will display the title dynamically okay we will send title uh, text from the route okay that's why here i am writing this okay now inside bo body i will write some message like home page content and save this go to routes.js file now i will not use this line just remove this here i will use race dot render okay and here i will just write the name of the file okay so i will use this index dot ejs so no need to write the extension here just write the file name index and then here we will pass any uh, any variable that is used in this file so here you can see a title variable is using here okay so here we have to just write title and we have to assign some value to this so here i am writing home page okay if i save this and now if i come here and refresh this page now, then here you can see the this page is now rendered in this home route okay if i just click on view page source then you can see the codings okay now next what i will do is i will uh, i will use bootstrap pipe here to design this uh, application okay so we have to include bootstrap pipe cdn link into this application okay so for this just go to your web browser and open cdnjs.com okay from this site we will get all the cdn link of front-end libraries okay so here just search for bootstrap okay now this is tutor bootstrap just click on this now select the latest version so i'm using this 5.0.0 .0 .0 version okay 
now from here just copy low and first copy this uh, link so i will copy the link tag here and paste here okay and again i will also copy this bootstrap.bundle.min.js file okay so just click on this copy script tag and paste here i will also use font awesome library okay so here search for font awesome okay and from here just click on this copy link tag and paste here okay now next i will design the nav bar at the top first okay so i'm just going to copy the code from the previous um, application and paste here okay so just going to copy and just pasting here okay if i save this and now if i go to the browser and refresh then at the top you can see there is a nav bar uh, with some link home add users about and contact okay if i come here and let me show you the codes okay so here you can see a uh, in home link in href attribute i have passed this slash now if we click on this home uh, link then we will redirect to the home page okay and here you can see in add users anchor tag i have used slash add okay so if i click on this add user link then we will redirect to the add users page okay and we have to create the route for this uh, value okay so uh, next what i will do is i will create another folder inside view directory views directory okay so let's create a new folder with name layout okay and inside layout i will create two file first one is header dot ejs and second one is footer dot ejs okay in header i will just go to index dot ejs and uh, cut the header part from here up to nav just cut and go to header.ejs and paste here okay save this now again go to index.ejs select all cut and go to footer.ejs paste here save okay now if i go to index.ejs file then we can use this header.ejs and footer.ejs file inside this index.ejs file okay so we have to include these two files here okay so how to include we have to use ejs uh, tag unscaped tag okay and here we have to write include and then uh, just write header sorry not header we have to first write layout slash header okay and just copy the same line and here just write footer okay and just inside this we will create a container okay container inside container i will create a row and inside row i will create a column okay now inside this i will write some message home page content okay content if i save this now if i go to the browser and refresh then you can see the nav bar is displaying here and the content of the home page is also displaying here okay if i just check that this is working in this responsive view or not okay so this is working now next what i will do is if you go to this um, header dot ejs file then here you can see i have uh, created uh, sorry i have used this anchor tag here and in href attribute i have used this slash add so we have to create this route okay so just copy and go to routes dot ejs file and here create another route so using router we will create another git sorry git and here 
just use uh, this and here just use request and response now here what i will do is i will use raise dot render and here i will write add underscore user add underscore users and in title i will pass title add users okay we have to create this file inside view directory okay so just create this file with ejs extension now here also what i will do is just go to index.ejs file select all copy and paste here okay just change the content here add users page okay if i save this and go to the browser refresh now this is the home page now if i click on add users uh, link then we will redirect to this uh, route okay with uh, this page okay add users page and we are displaying here the content of add users page okay now here what i will do is i will create a form okay so here also i'm not going to code i'm just going to copy and paste from the previous uh, application okay so if i go to add users ejs then just i'm going to copy this column code and paste here okay if i save this now if i go to the browser and refresh then you can see a form with some input fields like name email phone and select image uh, input field okay and let me show you the form coding okay so inside container i have created a row now inside this uh, row i have created a column and inside this column i have created a card and inside this card i have created a card header with this text okay and then uh, i have created card body and inside this card body i have created a form with the action now in action you can see i have or uh, i have already used this route in routes.js uh, file but this is git method okay and in this form in action i have used the same route name but i will use this route as post method okay so this will differentiate both the route okay and we will use post method to send data from the form to the database okay now here you can see in form i have used method post and i have also used an id and you can see i have used ink type okay now this is very important because i am also uploading image from this form so you have to use ink type and in ink type you have to write multi-part slash form data okay now you can see i have uh, defined all the input field like name email and in all the field i have uh, used name attribute with the value in name i have used name in email i have used email similarly in phone i have used phone and in image uh, i have used name equal to image okay and finally i have a submit button with the uh, name submit okay so this is the uh, add users page okay and if we click on home then we are redirected to the home page again okay now here in home page we will display all the records from the database in a table format okay so for this just go to index.ejs file and here what i will do is first i will create a table okay so actually here i will create a div with class table responsive okay now inside this i will create a table with the class table table strip okay inside table i will sorry we have to use table not div okay table and inside table we will use t head inside t head we will use tr 
and inside tr i will use id okay so just use th id here i will display the id then i will display the image then i will display the name then email then phone okay and then one action column okay if i save this and go to the browser and refresh then you can see all the columns here but here i will use margin top and bottom to four okay now here i will do one more thing i will give a class to this tr tag table dark okay now next i will also use here text center okay now next what i will do is i will create t body t body and side t body i will use tr td and here i am just using some dummy row okay so here in image i will use img tag and here i will write the name sahil kumar and email and here i will display the phone number okay and here i will design two icons two action icons okay so here i will use action sorry anchor tag and here i will use font awesome library fas fa edit sorry fa edit fa lg okay and margin left and right one okay and also i will give some class to this anchor tag text success if i save this and go to the browser and refresh then you can see the icon here okay now for delete icon let's just copy the same anchor tag here just change to danger and here just write app trash app trash if i refresh then you can see the delete icon okay now this is a static record okay now in next video i will show you how to insert record from this form into database and i will also show you how to fetch all record from the database and display here dynamically okay so thanks for watching this video please like and share this video and also subscribe this channel see you soon in the next video